Good morning, good morning. Alright, I don't fully remember what we were doing. Let's find out. Grumble, grumble. Hey, Van. Is something wrong with Burly? She seems a little... upset. Oh, about that. Well, you see... Let me explain. Look at this poll. Can you believe it? What are we looking at? Yeah, I don't see it. Exactly. The tether ball is missing. Van here used his arms and swung too hard, and now the ball's gone far off somewhere. Good morning, Wynn. Never to be seen again. I told you not to use your arms, Van. You gotta use your head. Like this. <laughs> Sorry, Burly. Using my head all the time gives me a headache. That's because you don't have a hard head like I do. Oh, something just, just hit me. I'm sure I saw the ball flying off somewhere in that direction. Into the vast forest? Ugh. We'll never find it now. It might be as, as- It might as well be lost forever. Hey, don't sweat it, Burly. We'll look for the ball for you. Heh. You sure you want to do that? Vast forest is a pretty dangerous place, you know. One time, I even got into a super grisly brawl with this ugly plant creature with dead, empty eyes and a gaping mouth. I outwitted it, of course, being cool and smart and all. There's no monster in all of the universe that can outrun me. <laughs> oh, I love them. Say, Omori, why don't you and your friends go with Burly and keep her out of trouble? I'd go myself, but... Van! Browse ran over bangs again. Oh, jeez. There's my cue. I'm coming, Happy. Be safe out there, you guys. I'll see you when you get back. Come on, Burly, let's go find your lost ball. We don't have anything to worry about as long as we're together. Hello, welcome. Yeah, I'm liking this game so far, too. I know it gets fucked up. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm waiting. <laughs> I'm scared. Hello. Uh, let's just get this over with. Burly. Oh, okay. We got Burly now. Do they have a little, um, icon? No. So they're useless to me. Oh, 
Oh, right, the, uh, the ladder. Right? Maybe? Oh. Okay, fine, I'll do your ball thing. I do need to kill these, I guess. Ugh, I need my chart. Too stupid to keep remembering this. Okay. Who do I like? I don't know yet. Honestly, no one has jumped out at me in particular. Um, I kind of just like everybody. But I am still at the, I think, pretty early in the game. I love their expressions and their, like, I love all their different emotions. Like, happy uh, Omari looks really cute. On this way? Oh, I guess not. Oh. Okay. Just a tire swing. That's all. not have Cult of the Lamb, but I have been meaning to look into it. I might play it um, after I finish all the games I'm playing right now. It looks really cute. And fucked up. Which I love. It also looks like genuinely very fun, because it's sort of a... Is it, is it a roguelike? Maybe? I don't actually know what kind of game it is. I've only seen like the the, um, like, cult follower mechanic. I don't actually know what the gameplay is like. Okay, okay. Yeah, that's one that I do want to play. Cult of the Lamb also just looks very nice. Like, the art style is really cute. It looks super polished. Ah! Ah! 
I love the slight change in expression in the bunnies. Like the one with the angry eyebrows. <laughs> boost their attack, huh? Very cool that I cannot remove the knife. This game has a pretty cool mechanic where um, you have the opportunity to look to your teammates and have them like gain an additional attack, but it goes so fast that like I can't think about it strategically. I just sort of mash one of the directional buttons. It's like, oh shit, uh, I don't know. I don't even read which one I'm selecting. been up here so I'm pretty sure it's not different but how is there I'm telling you how is there a ladder on the docks that don't make much sense this guy. Nope. His advice was only okay. I'm a Mori. I'm okay. So true. Oh, I should attack the angry guy. I'm stupid. Oh, Kel might die here. <laughs> not realize it looped what 
Interesting. Where's this stupid ball? Level five. Bread. <laughs> Omari learned bread slice. Do it fine. Level five, baby. Where's this fucking ball? Oh, is that the ball? The ball. Sweet, there's my lost ball. Yoink. Finally. Let's take this bad boy to the playground. I'm itching to play some tetherball. How did it get over there? What's this? Yep. No, 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 no. I'm done. I'm done fighting. Please. Just a little guy. Burly is so cute. Like, what are they? But am I bonk not sound? Why is everything broken right now? Hold on. <laughs> Wait, that worked. My, I apologize. My sound redeems have been just all over the place lately. Sometimes they'll work, sometimes they won't. Sometimes it'll like come from one headphone and not the other. <laughs> the 
Thank you. <laughs> Well, that was fun. Not. I'm gonna go play some tetherball. See you later, alligators. I'm out of here. But seriously, come see me before you go. I got something special for you. Nice. Burly is cute. I don't know what they are. I can't tell what they look like. Do they have a, t they have a tail and like horns? Are they a little like dinosaur? What are you? Hey dudes, thanks for getting my lost ball back. As you can see, I'm putting it to good use. Yep, she sure is. I was thinking, since you were all so kind to help me out, I'm gonna be generous and teach you one, my special skill. But first I got a question for y'all. Which one of you has the hardest head? <laughs> well, duh, that'd have to be Aubrey. What did you say? Whoa, chill out. No hard feel- no hard feelings. Get it? Heh. <laughs> that sounds about right. Alright, Aubrey, I'm gonna teach you a skill, just between hard-headed folks like us. It's my specialty, headbutt. It's simple, really. You just run up to somebody and... <laughs> now you try. That looks like it would hurt. And also mess up my hair. And also ruin my bow. Come on, Aubrey. Live a little. Having messy hair never hurt anyone. Hero is living proof of that. <laughs> yeah, you bet. <laughs> Fine. But if I'm doing this, I'm gonna give it all I've got. <laughs> Ugh, I feel dizzy. Whoa, nice one, Aubrey. I knew I saw talent in you. Congratulations. You passed the test with flying colors. Huh? What's happening? From this day forth, I hereby declare you a bona fide headbutter. Aubrey learned headbutt. And take the certificate. Show your friends. I'm sure they'll be proud. You got a butt certificate. Wow. Is it a real item that I have? Yep, there it is. Butt certificate. Use. <laughs> Stupid. She is like a Pokemon, you're right. I desperately need to, need to heal. <laughs> how do I know how many rabbits I've killed? Is my OP. I'm stupid. I'm sorry. I don't know what that means. Wait, what is the stump? Oh. What is OP? OTP? Overpowered. Oh, oops. 
Wait, I haven't been up here since I like... Who is my best of my- of the- of the four? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I- I use them all pretty equally. Um, probably Amori because they're always like one level ahead of everybody. <laughs> Um, otherwise, like, I I haven't paid enough attention to, like, their playstyle to get a good hang of it. Honestly, though, Aubrey seems to last the longest. I don't know why, um, but she tends to die, I think, last. I could be misremembering, though. Remember what Mari said, Amori. You're stronger than you think. Don't worry, we'll be right behind you. Yeah, and if you fall, we'll be right here to catch you. Kel, don't scare him. You won't fall, Omori. I promise. Here we go again. You can do it, bud. Oh, you are no longer afraid of heights. Oh. Oh, we're booking it. New. Man, I know there's a reason why we've never climbed this ladder, but I can't put my finger on it. It's on the tip of my tongue. Oh well. Here goes nothing. I don't like where this is going. Wait, hold up, guys. Shoot. Where is he? I just had him. Oh no, is it his rock? Where is who? Hector, my pet rock. I swear I just had him in my pocket. No, Hector. <laughs> he must have fallen out of my pocket when I wasn't paying attention. I mean, that just means he's at the bottom of the ladder, right? You're fine. I'm sorry, Hector. I should have been more careful. What's the big deal? It's just a rock, right? Don't you dare say that. He's not just a rock. He's family. Don't worry. I'm sure he'll turn up soon, Kel. Probably. I sure hope so. Wait for me, Hector. I'll find you. I promise. <laughs> oh, bro, I should have saved before climbing this. Uh. Ah, snake? Snake. Snake. Goodbye. Don't like that texture. What? What? Huh? At <laughs> first. Are we in space? <sighs> the ladder. It just never ends. Ha <laughs> cute. That's one small step for Kel, and one large step for Kel kind. That's not how it goes. You don't get to decide how it goes. You weren't here first. Wait, hold on. Is that my butt certificate? Take that thing down right now. What if somebody sees it? No way! Look at this thing fluttering in the wind. So majestic. So beautiful. Hero, do something! 
<laughs> One sec. Just catching my breath. Actually, give me a minute. Is he good? Never mind. <laughs> I suppose that he wouldn't have the flag if I didn't get the certificate, right? Other world campsite. Can I go back down? Hmm. Cute. Other world. What? Wait, why don't we come up here? Look at that little house. Oh my god, this is so cute. Oh, thank god, Mari's here. Gumbo, happy! Good for Gumbo, good for you. That's a Tamagotchi. <laughs> so many humans today. You guys are always such big fans of space travel. One soda, please. Alright, I imagine that the bus station is eventually going to be used for, like, fast travel. It's at times like this that I'm reminded that our universe is beautiful. So true. Mari, what are you doing here? Huh? Welcome to the <laughs> Welcome to Otherworld. An unofficial pit stop for weary space travelers and a popular family-friendly camping ground. Ah. Don't you just love the smell of firewood and the sound of running water and the crisp space breeze? It all makes the vast emptiness of space a little more bearable, don't you think? Soda. Carbonated Hell Sludge. Damn, what do they have against cherry soda? They've got cherry soda and tasty soda. Sparkler causes happy. That's cute. Oh, a floating mirror. Your friends smile warmly behind you. Horse water. I like the wanted poster. This guy looks pretty intimidating. Do you want to disturb him? Yes. Oh! Oh no. Was this a mistake? Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh no.
Why is the song so good? Try something stupid. This guy's probably gonna like kill me in one hit. What is he? Why do you have your own theme music? damage when, she, when she's angry. That's good. Oh, I mean, I'm just gonna die, but I'm gonna see this fight through to the end. Splendid show of force. What the fuck? What? What is this? and not his arms. Does that protect me from three different attacks? Yo, my healing items kind of suck, huh? Really should have prepared better. Kids fought well, but you lack training. 
rough. That was like kind of fun though. Oh my god, wait, I didn't mean this. I don't actually want to try again. Can I run? Bye. What the fuck is happening? Oh my god. Is he gone? Can I just never try that again? I think I did pretty well. <laughs> Junior just doesn't know how to stay put. All he wants to do is go outside. Sorry to bother you, but have you seen my son anywhere? We looked away for less than a second, and he's gone and ran off again. Could you keep an eye out for me? You'll know when you see him. He looks just like me. Ha! Huh? Sure. Crap, I forgot my camera at home. What a good camp- What's a good camping trip if I can't take any pictures? Look at this- This house is so cute. A little centaur dude. Small. I'm small. The world's smallest centaur. Look at all my awards. What the hell? Tiniest centaur, first place. Most horse, second place. Miniest centaur, first place. Smallest centaur, first place. Littlest centaur, first place. The book was dusty and I sneezed and now I'm fighting dust, I think. It's pissed off. Dust bunny. It's really angry. Oh, and it died. I hope this horse isn't gonna be mad that I Killed its dust? It's not, okay. Weird. Oh my god, this house. This place used to be a pristine wildlife preserve, but due to a recent boom in tourism, it's starting to accumulate a lot of trash. Pick up your trash, people. It's not that hard. So true. Whoa. Oh my god. Hi, I'm Pessy. And as you probably noticed, I love Sweetheart. I got every piece of merchandise she's ever released. I got Sweetheart posters, figures, stickers, shirts, her entire discography, and anything else you can think of. I'm certain that you won't find a more thorough collection anywhere else in the world. Calling me a super fan is an understatement. I am the ultimate fan. Let me tell you about the time I almost met, sweetheart. We just happened to be eating at the same restaurant. It was fate, I think. We ordered the same meal, too. Not like I totally saw what she ordered and copied her or anything. I even tried to pay for her meal, but I had just bought a newly released Sweetheart life-size statue the other day, and I couldn't afford to. Which I guess ended up being a good thing, since the girl- since that girl turned out to be some regular girl wearing a costume that kind of looked like Sweetheart's anyway. Not like I couldn't- I couldn't tell in the first place, only a poser fan would ever make a mistake- would ever mistake a regular person for Sweetheart. Oh my god, she's crazy. Oh, <laughs> thank you, Win. Ha! 
<laughs> a surprisingly normal bed. I want to meet the real sweetheart. I love the Hume laugh, like worked into the theme song. I found a can! Digging through the trash! That recycling machine just gave me a cool prize recycling some cans. Recycling does pay off! The recycling machine dispensed five clams. Thank you for doing your part in keeping the environment clean. Wow! That took a really long time. A band of space pirates has been camping out here for a long time now. I hear that the captain suddenly decided he wasn't going to travel anymore, so half of the crew took his ship and left. Alright. Halt, children! You are now entering the vicinity of the captain of the space pirates, the master of the solar system, the prince of the universe, the one and only Captain Space... B I mean, uh, you are entering the house of s space boyfriend. Oh, this bitch. I think I've seen this person before. Whoa, the captain of the space pirates live here? That's awesome. I want to be a space pirate too. Uh, yeah, well, so did I. Once. Space boyfriend doesn't do much these days, so most of the space pirates got fed up and left with the main ship. It's just us stragglers here doing all the space boyfriend's chores and whatever. Yesterday, me and the guy spent the day cleaning and throwing away all of his trash. I didn't leave my old job for this. I ain't no babysitter. Oh, I'm sorry. That sounds awful. And maybe we can talk some sense into him. Oh, I wouldn't do that if I were you. Captain Space... B <sighs> I mean... Space Boyfriend's got two sides to him, you see. We should at least try. You never know. He might know something about how to find Basil. Or maybe he knows where to find my pet rock, Hector. Y yeah sure, that too. What are we waiting for? Let's go see him already. Sorry about your job, sir. It'll get better soon, I promise. <sighs> Thank you, little lady. I sure hope so. Okay. I'm in a cliffhanger this shit. And meet him next week. Yeah, I'm gonna go save, because I got to go. And then next, presumably, since my schedule is just the same every week, because I'm lazy. Uh, next Wednesday, I will be picking this back up. And presumably, I'll be meeting Space Boyfriend. <laughs> Something to look forward to. I'm still in the prologue. think okay uh thanks for hanging out have a good day y'all uh, bye bye